Pardon me. More tea, Vicar. Hey YouTube, x 2708 here, and uh, a couple of uh, barren days without any packages, but uh, three came through this morning. Uh, so I've got three packages to uh, to open with you guys, and uh, one pickup as well. So let's uh, crack them open, guys, and show you what we've got. So first of all, guys, got a package through the post here this morning, and it's come all the way from Belgium. By the look of it, this is a, uh, or I'm presuming, it's a, it's a trade that I've done with um, one of my subscribers, a chap called um, Stygen, or Sturgeon, not too sure how to pronounce your name matey, so uh, apologies on that front, but uh, S-T-I-J-N is the spelling of the subscriber. Uh, so, let's show you what, uh, what he sent me through first of all guys, and then I'll tell you what I traded. Uh, this came through incredibly quickly. Like I said, this is a, a trade from Belgium and the chap contacted me on Monday morning to say, been down the post office today, sent it through for you. Um, I sent his package out on Monday over to Belgium as well and he contacted me, contacted me this morning to say it's arrived. So two days to get to, uh, to, to Belgium. So fantastic that was. So first of all, Oh, there's a bit of a Brucey bonus in here as well, so I'll share that with you guys afterwards. <coughs> right. Okay, excellent. There we go, guys. So this is what um, what the main trade was. So Herzog Zvi on the Mega Drive, Wee Willy Winky intact, and there you go. Brilliant. Cartridge and manual. So nice and complete. Uh, basically, what I traded in was three of my uh, Sega Master System games. So they they were only common ones. Um, I won't tell you what they are in case he does do a package video. Uh, but three common Master System games from uh, from the UK uh, for this one here. And he said I'll put a Brucey bonus in for you as well because obviously the three Master System games will be more postage for you. Um, so this game was one of my ten for the month last month that I wasn't able to get hold of. Um, so he got in touch with me over the weekend, I think it was, and said, I've got it if you want to do a trade. So, so that was that one. Okay, and here's the, the Brucey bonus. So let's, uh, let's have a little look and see what he sent through. Oh, brilliant. Here we go, guys. Let's take this out the, out the box so you can see. So it's a Game Boy game, so something I can play in my um, uh, my Game Boy player for the SNES. Right, and it is F15 Strike Eagle. So some sort of fighter pilot type game by the look of it. So I'll crack that on later and uh, and see how that plays. But uh, yeah, thanks very much to uh, to Stygen for sending that through and uh, you know getting in touch in the in the first place and uh, offering me the trade to help me out with my collection so that uh, I think that puts me now at 177 Mega Drive games so still kind of on target for 200 by Christmas which is the main aim right so that was that one next one uh, this is from let's have a look from a very good friend of mine just around the corner I'll cover his address up uh, and there's the parcel and I think this is from my very good friend Mr Ian Wilson so, fellow uh, Mega Drive fanatic like myself, and he got in touch with me the other day to say I've got a spare game if uh, if you'd like it for your collection. So uh, again, sent it through the other day, and you know, come through nice and quickly, which is pretty uh, miraculous, really, with the postal strikes and that that are going on. Right, and we have a little little note as well from Ian. Right, let's have a look. Uh, <laughs> good lad. Uh, hey X-File, I had this going spare, thought you would appreciate it. It was the very first game released for the Mega Drive over in Japan, and it's even got a wee willy winky. Enjoy, mate. Nice one. So let's put that to, to one side and show you what uh, Ian sent me through. Of 
course it's brilliant condition as well we know how uh, Ian likes to collect them and we have the Japanese version of Space Harrier 2 good to his word wee willy winky intact and fantastic that looks really sweet actually the manual there and cartridge so nice and complete so I am trying to get a few um, Japanese games for my collection I'm not going too overboard on collecting them but if I can trade them with people then uh, you know I am looking to, uh, to to add some to the collection so that's my second Japanese game that I've got now the first one I got a while ago which was Crackdown which uh, is an absolutely fantastic game so thanks very much to Ian for sending that through uh, I should think the majority of people already know Ian he's going for a, a full uh, Japanese Mega Drive collection uh, but he's got an absolutely fantastic channel if you're not subscribed to him head over check his channel out and subscribe guys so uh, I think he's close to about 90 games now for uh, for his Japanese uh, Mega Drive collection so he does some absolutely fantastic gameplay videos and uh, you know showcases a lot of games that uh, that people won't have heard of before so check him out guys and uh, once again thanks very much Ian very much appreciated Right, that's number two, and the third one, I'm not too sure which which this one is, it's it's going to be an eBay purchase, but uh, one one is a, a retro game that I'm waiting for, the other one is something for my mobile phone, so let's uh, take a look and see which one it is. And it's the game, brilliant, here we go guys, been looking forward to getting this one through, finally we have... Super Pro Protector. So I've been looking for this for for a good week or so since Lefarius put the um, the gameplay challenge video up. Um, got a good deal on this on eBay. Uh, as you can see, it's just loose card, so it's not boxed. Uh, but it was. Um, I think this game generally goes for about ten or fifteen pounds. So it's Super Pro Protector, aka Contra Three, I think it is. Um, but uh, you know it's a very, very popular game normally goes for between 10 and 15 pound just as a loose cart on eBay uh, and I managed it was a it was a buy it now 9.99 or best offer so uh, being the cheeky chappy that I am I put a best offer in of 7 pound 50 with free delivery and it was accepted so super pro detector pro for the SNES for 7 pound 50 and uh, free delivery so I'll be doing my challenge video on this one later, so watch out guys, here I come. Oh, excuse me, slippy floor, it's absolutely pissing it down with rain outside. And the last pick of guys, Blockbusters the other day. And we have, for the Xbox 360, I know it's not um, uh, PS3 like I'm uh, collecting for at the moment, but uh, Xbox 360 game, Call of Duty 2. And there you go, complete, upside down disc, there we go. And that was £7.95 in Blockbusters. Um, so basically I'm trying to get all the Call of Duties on the consoles now. I've got them all on um, on PC, but I'm trying to get into the good first person shooters on 360 and PlayStation 3. Um, so I've now got Call of Duty 2, Call of Duty 3 and World at War, so I just need Call of Duty 4 when it finally comes down in price uh, to uh, to complete the collection on 360 but uh, like I say, I saw this in Blockbusters the other day, just £7.95 um, typically this normally goes for about between £13 and £15 normally so I think it is considered one of the best Call of Duties out there uh, and it's the first one that I need obviously on, uh, on 360, I want to play the series through from start to end, so uh, I can now start uh, start that mission. So uh, yeah, was pleased to add that to the collection for just seven pound ninety five. But uh, that's it for now, guys. So I've got a couple of um, challenge videos to be doing. I'll be doing the Streets of Rage two challenge later on today. That will be the second take because the battery ran out on the camcorder while I was doing my first take last night. Um, and then I'll be doing Super Pro Protector in uh, in response to. Uh, Lefarius's challenge as well so uh, a couple of videos coming out guys so uh, watch this space so as always thanks very much for watching and I'll put up another video shortly bye for now